yesterday of the Prime Minister's visit to Lakshadweep. It's of course changed everyone's travel goals for 2024. But the video of him snorkeling has, believe it or not, triggered a political fight. Election season, almost everything turns political. So did that video. How exactly? We break down for you in this report how the Congress has responded and even compared it to Rahul Gandhi and how he didn't have a life jacket on versus Prime Minister Modi had a life jacket on. Let's play out our next report for you. These images from Prime Minister Narendra Modi's recent trip to Lakshadweep are a huge hit on the internet. During the visit to kickstart various development projects, Prime Minister Modi was seen taking time off from his busy schedule to explore the islands. From early morning walks on the pristine beaches to spending time in solitude on the seashore, Prime Minister Modi did it all. But what caught public imagination the most is him snorkeling and seeing the priceless coral ecosystem. The beautiful images shared by the Prime Minister have prompted many to add the Union Territory to their bucket list. However, the Prime Minister's snorkeling pictures were quick to grab the Congress's criticism. Raising questions on the Prime Minister's trip, the Grand Old Party launched scathing attacks. Drawing parallels between an old video of Rahul Gandhi, the Congress said that Rahul had jumped into the deep sea without any safety apparatus. And Prime Minister on the other end is wearing a life jacket. The politics aside, Prime Minister Modi's visit has put the spotlight on Lakshadweep, an archipelago of 36 islands with an area of just 32 square kilometers. India's smallest union territory can expect a big boost to tourism soon. Bureau Report, India Today. Well, Gautam Adani has made a comeback. What a comeback it is. He's back at the number one spot as India's richest man and even Asia's richest. Essentially, he's defeated Mukesh Ambani. And why do we call it a comeback? Because after the Hindenburg report, 